So Mayor Bowser, I do these interviews all the time and I've never received more mm -hmm. email for one interview than for this one. Uh, on May 1st, you oh, ordered wow. your, oh yeah, no, I'm not kidding around. Your order requiring guests at weddings and one-time events to stay seated and socially distanced went into effect. The key part of the order for those who emailed reads, standing and dancing receptions are not allowed. Why not? And how will that be enforced? Well, Jonathan, actually what the May 1st order did was open those venues for the first time since the pandemic um, has affected us and affected uh, the world. Uh, I, we're very pleased that our businesses and residents have uh, strictly followed public health guidance that's allowing us uh, to begin to turn that dial and open up the city. So we have fans uh, in our sporting venues. Uh, we have a guest uh, at our restaurants, indoors and outdoors. Our public facilities are opening. And yes, now we can have regional uh, meetings and weddings in our convention center uh, and in our uh, and at all of our hotel venues. Uh, we are very focused, however, on making sure we're maintaining physical distance, and that's been the case uh, throughout the pandemic. So, I mean, even Maryland and Virginia are allowing dancing if you're masked and socially distanced. Why not allow for that, at least here in the district? Well, we think and we expect um, that given our case rates and how they're going down even more quickly um, than we thought, uh, that we will be able to, to ease restrictions across the board. And we're looking forward to being able to do that very soon. Um, can you put a timeline on very soon? Or I mean, it's only May 6th. Could it be by before the end of this month, before Memorial Day? Um, I think what we've seen and what we've done throughout the pandemic was look at the dates at which we turn up activity, um, which was on May 1st, watch um, what that could do to our case rates. They could go up or they can continue to go down, which we fully expect. And then after a reasonable time watching um, that turned up activity and what it does, then we can turn up more activity and that's what we expect. We've also been very focused since this vaccine is now um, plentiful uh, and in some cases exceeding uh, the demand that we see across the city. Uh, we have about 36% of our residents that are fully vaccinated. We know we've got to do a lot better in order to protect our residents. So it's not only that we want to get open, uh, we want to stay open. Uh, and the way to do that is to make sure that more and more people are getting vaccinated. I think the president is right to challenge us to look to July 4th uh, to get to 60, 70 percent uh, vaccination rate among adults. I think we all need to stay focused on that. Turning up activity, yes, uh, but turning up vaccination is even more important.